And developing tonight, vandal strike again, taking aim at another house of worship. The most recent case happened just before the holidays. 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards has details. Why someone would want to damage a church is hard for parishioners to understand. But in mid-December, that's exactly what someone did outside of St. Priscilla's Catholic Church in Livonia. They tried to etch into the, uh, the base of the statue with nails is what they tried to do. According to Sam Atherton, the church's maintenance supervisor, the person or people responsible carved some unrecognizable symbols. But their work wasn't done. On the other side of the building, they uh, probably the same people did that. They decided to drive through the lawn, so they did uh, a number of donuts on the lawn. This is the third case of vandalism Livonia police are investigating involving Catholic property. Just earlier this month, St. Colette Catholic Church's doors were spray painted with offensive messages, and the sidewalks at the convent down the road were spray painted as well. It's not clear if these cases are all connected. Meanwhile, Atherton says. He'll pray for whoever did this. They obviously need some, need some guidance, so God can give that to them. They obviously don't have anything to do in their life. They need uh, more positive things to do. If you have any information on this case, call Livonia Police. Whoever is responsible could spend a long time behind bars because vandalizing a church is a serious felony. In Livonia, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.